Hey, what's going on, everybody? It is your boy Hobo here today, and as you can see, we're playing more Madden NFL 19. Other than the fact that it's not Madden 19, this is Madden NFL 07 on the PlayStation 2. And today we're playing the Pro Bowl because later today is the Pro Bowl, and we're joined by a special guest for this special event. It's your boy Z. I'm back again, even though I don't use my YouTube channel. So he's here. We're I don't playing. Use it. <laughs> we're playing the Pro Bowl on Madden 07. Because it's like the only Madden game I own where you have the uh, different helmets for the AFC and the NFC. So, uh, in other news, this is not primarily what we're concerned about. Not this specific Pro Bowl game. Because obviously this is from, what, 12 years ago? So, these rosters are probably not the correct ones you're going to be seeing tonight. Unless Tom Brady's on this team. Well, <laughs> actually you won't see it tonight because Tom Brady. Because Brady's in the Super Bowl. So... <laughs> We're going to be breaking down who's on which squad and which squad we think is going to win, Ski. So let's start with the AFC in their offense. They will be trotting out quarterbacks Patrick Mahomes, Andrew Luck, Deshaun Watson. Luck and Watson replacing Tom Brady and Phillip Rivers. What do you think of that quarterback trio? I think um, that Pat Mahomes is going to be the only one to pl play. I think, well, actually, no. The Pro Bowl, they switch it up every quarter, I'm pretty sure. But they also, they, I I think that Pat Mahomes is a gunner. We've seen it all season. He, Phillip Rivers is even getting to that point where he's actually a decent kind of quarterback sometimes-ish. And I think with that, it's just, and I don't think the AFC is going to win because of their quarterback matchup, obviously, but the quarterbacks are definitely better in the AFC than they are in the NFC. Interesting point about Phillip Rivers because he's not playing in the game. He's not? No. I, I just said Rivers and Brady are replaced by Andrew oh, Luck right, and Deshaun right. Watson. But still, Andrew Luck is... Deshaun Watson, I think, is that's the only thing that matters. I think Deshaun, De Watson, I think Deshaun Watson is probably <laughs> gonna the play second... Most of the game. He's the second best quarterback on that team. I think so. He deserves it. But clearly, I think Patrick Mahomes is the best quarterback the AFC has. Even if Brady and Rivers were to play, I would still say Mahomes is the best quarterback that would be playing in the Pro Bowl for either team because he's that freaking good. How do you throw 50 touchdown passes in basically your first year? Well, play baseball for, you know, however many years. Damn. <laughs> Kyler Murray to the Giants. <clears throat> so the quarterbacks look pretty good for the AFC as Michael Strahan just ate could shit. All right, nice, nice. Oh, that's a, a giant back there playing safety. Really? Yeah. So the running backs for the AFC are James Connor, Melvin Gordon, Lamar Miller, who replaces Philip Lindsay, who will not be participating in the Pro Bowl. Now Philip isn't playing because he's hurt, right? I th I believe so, but Connor was a, a revelation for the, Steelers. for the Steelers this year. Without Le'Veon Bell, he came in and, and basically put up Le'Veon Bell numbers. Yeah. Without Lady having that name in that cap. So when the Steelers eventually cut ties with that waste of oxygen, the, they will really be in a much better position. Look at this. Hussein Muhammad, Tory Holt, Brad Johnson, and Tiki Barber. I think that's Brad Johnson. Oh, good job, Tiki. Good job, Tiki. So, uh, so Connor probably... You know, I, I think it's a toss-up between him and Melvin Gordon for the best for the best running, running back. back in the AFC. Yes, and Melvin Gordon is very good. Star. He's very good. Too bad they couldn't make it past the Patriots in the playoffs. But then again, the Rams even won't. So they're the they're the Tory Holt. Good job. Straddle the sideline. That's a touchdown. Tory Holt. <gasps> NFC. That's why the NFC is in the zone. <laughs> and Lamar Miller. Dude had a 98-yard run for a touchdown this year, which is insane. Lamar Miller. And the, the Texans, the poor freaking Texans, man. They got the raw end of the deal having to play the Colts. Because if they were to have played the Titans in that wild card game, yeah. they would have steamrolled them. But uh, it's, what, it's whatever. And then the Colts, clearly they weren't anything special because they got murdered by Kansas City. Yeah. Fullback Anthony Sherman of the Kansas City Chiefs. As we all know, he's probably one of the best fullbacks and probably the only fullback left. Uh, the receivers for the American Football Conference are as follows. We have Tyreek Hill, 
DeAndre Hopkins, who will not play. He was replaced by Jarvis Landry. Keenan Allen of the L.A. Chargers. Antonio Brown, who will not play, was replaced by Juju Smith-Schuster. So basically it's Tyreek Hill, Keenan Allen, Jarvis Landry, Juju Smith-Schuster. I mean, my boy's in the AFC Pro Bowl. Juju Smith-Schuster? No, 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 no. No, not Juju. Jarvis? Jarvis. Jarvis Landry. I really like this receiving core. I just wish DeAndre Hopkins would be able to play in the game because they'd win by default. <laughs> and look at that. Was that Michael Strahan? No, that wasn't. But Michael Strahan's eventually going to get Tom Brady, and Brady's going to have nightmares. <laughs> but um, I really like that receiving unit. Too bad. Well, I mean, I don't really care about Antonio Brown not playing because I don't think he's that good anyway. Who the hell? LaDainian Tomlinson. Jesus. Nice. <laughs> but uh, I, I don't think Brown's especially great anyway, so. No. I think Juju's better than him. Yeah, I think Juju's better than Brown. Obviously, Jarvis Landry was a snub. Glad he makes it in. But poor DeAndre Hopkins. Yeah, Tyreek no. Hill, obviously. Why is it DeAndre playing? Injury or just decided he didn't want to? And, well, it's either one or the other. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, Tyreek Hill, I'm, I'm glad to see him in the Pro Bowl. Absolutely murderer Tyreek Hill is. He, he's he's just the best. I don't know any way to put it other than Speedy that. Speedy has hands. Speedy, great hands, can take hits. Dude's a, an animal. Tight ends for the American Football Conference will be Eric Ebron and Jared Cook. Jared Cook is replacing Travis Kelsey. I would rather have Travis, Kel- Travis Kelsey. Yeah, and, and Eric Ebron... I, I cannot stand Eric Ebron uh, as I return this kick for a 40-yard game. I can't stand Eric Ebron. You should have seen it at the Pro Bowl dodgeball challenge. Yeah. You know how everybody just likes to have fun at the Pro Bowl? Yeah. He started swearing while there's kids literally right next to him at the NFC. <laughs> like, what kind of a scumbag are you? I couldn't even believe it. They had to bleep it out on the on the ESPN stream of it. Look at this. Look at that throw. Goodness, I'm benching my quarterback. <laughs> we'll get back into the 2019 NFC. Just a minute. Just here. a minute. I mean Pro Bowl. Let's we'll figure out how to play this game. Coaching strategy. There we go. So what? No. Depth chart. You're Kurt Warner. And Mark Bulger. Mark. Brad Johnson. <laughs> Put Jay Feely in. Mark Bulger. All right, it's up to Kurt Warner to win this game. I wonder what my what my backups are. Do I have any actually decent backups? Trent, Trent Green, Green, nice. Steve McNair. Yeah, oh, keep Brady in. Yeah, we keep Brady. Where's Peyton Manning? He's not a quarterback. <laughs> so the tight end situation for the NFC, I think, or for the AFC rather, I think looks pretty good. Their offensive line will be Taylor Luan, Alejandro Villanueva, Eric Fisher, David DeCastro, Marshall Yanda, Quentin Nelson, Joel Batonio, who is replacing David DeCastro, Marquise Pouncey, and Mike Pouncey. So the Pouncey brothers get to play together yeah. in the Pro Bowl. That's awesome. Hold on, I just want to run this one play with, with Tiki Barber, the second best running back in Giants history. All right, so... That does it for the offense of the AFC. The N- or the AFC's defense, highlighted by Miles Garrett. J.J. Watt, who will not play, uh, was replaced by Calais Campbell. Yeah. Melvin Ingram. Geno Atkins and Gerald Casey both won't play. They were replaced by Brandon Williams and Kyle Williams. Then uh, Cameron Hayward also is playing. Jadavian Clowney, who will not play, was replaced by T.J. Watt. Von Miller, D. Ford. C.J. Mosley. D. Ford, the man who literally lost the Chiefs Super Bowl chances. That That is the truth, as Tiki fumbles. Good job. Where was I? Ah, uh, C.J. Mosley, Bernard McKinney from the Texans, Xavier Howard, Jalen Ramsey, Stephon Gilmore, who will not play because he's in the Super Bowl, Denzel Ward, who could oh, win Denzel Rookie Ward, of the Year. That's the, that's the man right there. Chris Harris, Derwin James, Eric Weddle, Jamal Adams. They have a really good defense. I mean, besides the fact that they have Jalen Ramsey. 
Jalen Ramsey, Burt Toast, is 2K18. A, he is literally trash. Everything <laughs> Jalen Ramsey does. I, I love Jalen Ramsey, like, last year, and then he just came out this year and started talking shit about everybody, and that's okay. I get it. It's football. But then when you can't show up, like, you let Odell Beckham Jr. drop 100 on you in his first game, basically back from last year. It was his first game back from injury. Yeah. And you just let him walk in and drop 100 on one of the supposed to be best corners in football. Yeah, I mean, he's such an up and down player, but I, I don't even care to mention Jalen Ramsey because there's so much other talent that they have playing and corner McKinney, for that team. McKinney from the Texans and Denzel Ward. I mean, that just replaces Jalen Ramsey right there as Denzel Ward. Denzel Ward, Derwin James, same team. Amazing. How does that Jamal happen? Adams stole the Pro Bowl. When he tackled the New England Patriots mascot and yeah. got every single fan who was watching to cheer. Tory Holt! Oh my! Tory freaking Holt. What a god. Alright, so the special teams for the Poor American Football Conference will be Jason Myers from the Jets. Who? Not Kaimi Fairbairn. Why not Kaimi? I don't know. That that blows my mind. Brett Kern for the Texans will who? punt. <laughs> Casey Creeder from the Broncos will hold. Again, no idea. Andre Roberts from the Jets. He had th- the most return yardage, I believe, all year long of all kick returners. Is that and Lloyd Harris? No. <laughs> and special teamer Adrian Phillips from the Chargers. So that does it for the AFC. The NFC. Part that really matters. They will send quarterbacks Drew Brees, Jared Goff, and Andrew Rodgers. Aaron Rodgers. Andrew to the Pro Bowl, except none of them will play. Every single NFC quarterback is a replacement. Mitchell Trubisky, Russell Wilson, Dak Prescott, they lost. They lost. Just based on that. Yeah. When Mitchell Trubisky is the best quarterback on your team. That's an issue. Then you'll double doink. Then you'll double doink. The was... running backs, Todd Gurley, who will not participate because he's in the Super Bowl, Saquon Barkley, Ezekiel Elliott, and Alvin Kamara. Ra, ra. I wonder if... Uh, if Alvin Kamara will get roughed or pass interference with it and it won't get called. <coughs> I hope every Saints fan listening to that cries because you don't deserve to win anything. Kyle Juszczyk from the 49ers will play fullback and the wide receivers will be Julio Jones and Michael Thomas who will not play, obviously because neither of them are in the Super Bowl, especially not Michael Thomas. Uh, the remaining wide receivers for the NFC are Devontae Adams, Adam Thielen, Mike Evans, and Amari Cooper. Evans and Cooper are the replacements for Thomas and Adams. I can't believe Odell didn't get voted in. That's crazy. I think it doesn't really matter. and It's just a Pro Bowl, but... Yeah, but still. I don't know how Amari Cooper made it. He literally did basically nothing. I, I hate Amari Cooper. And I hate the Dallas Cowboys. And I hate this faggot, Tom Brady. Intercepted! Oh, Jesus. Darren fuck. Sharper. He put the team on his back with a broken leg. Oh, man. That was foul. Brady throws a huge pick six. So the tight ends for the NFC are Zach Ertz, who will not play. He is replaced by Austin Hooper. And the man, the myth, the legend, George Kittle from the 49ers. Absolutely love that man. George Kittle? Love him. He's, He's probably the best at his profession. Then the offensive line for the poor... No Giants players. <laughs> for the poor NFC is Taron Armstead, Tyron Smith, Trent Williams. Smith and Williams are replaced by Lane Johnson and Jake Matthews. Brandon Brooks, Zach Martin, who are both replaced by Andrus Pete and Larry Warford. Try Turner, Alex Mack, Max Unger. As Nate smashes the table. <laughs> With my hand. Ow. And then the defense for the NFC. This is where it gets really interesting. Cameron Jordan, Demarcus Lawrence, Daniil Hunter, Fletcher Cox, Aaron Donald, who's replaced by uh, Kwan Short, and Akeem Hicks. That is an amazing front seven. Right there, yeah. That is absolutely brutal. Good luck running the ball. And I know in the Pro Bowl you can't blitz and you can't stunt and all that nonsense, but still, good luck running the ball against that. do 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 Linebackers, Ryan Kerrigan, Khalil Mack, who will not play, replaced by Olivier Vernon of the New York Giants. Anthony Barr, Luke Keekley, Bobby Wagner, Leighton Vander Esch. 
Those linebackers are pretty good. Yeah, Van Der Esch, even though even though he's a uh, a cowboy, he's still good. I disagree with you, but <laughs> nobody on the Cowboys is good ever. Troy Aikman was terrible. Michael Irvin was straight trash. Every player that's ever played for them is garbage at their life. Intercepted. Damn it. Alrighty, corners and DBs. Kyle Fuller, Patrick Peterson, Byron Jones, Darius Slay, Eddie Jackson, Harrison Smith, Landon Collins, Malcolm Jenkins. So I guess Collins is gonna play. He's not. He just had a, he just had season end injury. I guess he is gonna play. How is he? It gonna doesn't play? it doesn't mark him as out and there's no replacement for him, so I think Collins is gonna play. That's awesome. Really? Yeah. It's sick. Yeah, it's indicating him as a starter. Him and Eddie Jackson are starting safeties. Wow. Awesome. And then on special teams, the best kicker in the entire league, Aldrick Rosas. Aldrick Rosas! <laughs> I'm buying his jersey. <laughs> he My deserves his jersey to get bought. Punter Michael Dixon from the Seahawks. Returner Tariq Cohen. Special teamer Corey Littleman. And special teamer Michael Thomas of the New York Giants. We had four Giants players go. Yeah. Wow. Pretty freaking awesome. For a 5-11 and 11 team. Yeah, I know. Because we have great talent, just a bad team. Just a, no, 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 let's not get too far. Bad quarterback. Bad quarterback. Lackluster defense. Amazing offense. Yeah. Should, ha should be amazing offense. So that is the rosters for the game. My money, personally, is on the AFC because they just have the NFC's number. And the NFC just seems to not be able to beat the AFC for some reason? Nah, we got Barkley. Don't even sweat. Like I think it was I think it was last year where Kirk Cousins was driving, right? For the NFC. Driving to score the game winning touchdown. Dude threw a game losing interception in the Pro Bowl. And the freaking Vikings gave him eighty thousand million dollars to do nothing, to miss the playoffs. Terrible. That's a pick. Come no, it's on, not. ladies. That's a catch. Oh, it was almost a catch if I timed it right. <laughs> but, uh... Um, Palomalu! Palomalu up the A-gap. What do you think? NFC. NFC? I think NFC. I think that... I, I think they're not going to use the quarterbacks a lot. I think if I think if the NFC decides they don't want to use the quarterbacks a lot and they don't have to, like, throw the ball, you know... If they then, run the ball more? Yeah, if they run the ball more, then Denzel Ward can't pick off anybody. <laughs> and... You're basically making it... You make them run streaks all the time so that the corners are way the hell out there and the safety's got to follow them, and then you just run the ball. Run a draw. And Barkley will find a hole. He's so really good at that. Barber. Barkley will find holes in the Giants offensive line. I can't imagine what he's going to do in the Pro Bowl. That's what we're going to see real Barkley is in the Pro Bowl. Yeah, and, and <laughs> with... And with the AFC, you have Patrick Mahomes playing quarterback yeah. with his own guy, Tyreek Hill. If they start that game, that combination is so deadly, yeah. they could drop 21 points before he even gets pulled. Right. And, like, I know the NFC has the biggest comeback in Pro Bowl history. I think they were down 28-13, to 13, and they came all the way back and won. But that's not that Pro Bowl team. This isn't Brett Favre throwing to Jerry Rice. This is Mitchell Trubisky throwing to someone. Mitchell Michael Trubisky Thomas. and George Kittle. No, he he's not going to be there. He's too heartbroken over the the, the call, no call. <laughs> Get out of here. It was a good call, by the way, just just to let everybody know. Just to let everyone know. Oh, good look call. at that. That right there, 77, is a New York Giant on the Pro Bowl offensive line. <laughs> Excuse me? Yep, right here in, in this Pro Bowl game. Nuts. Oh, I meant to throw to R1. Fourth down. I'm going for it. Oh, of course, right? I mean, why wouldn't we, right? Because I like to win. Okay, so basically, in all, I think the You're AFC. Punting. I think the AFC has a better all-around team. Why am I punting? That was dumb. But <laughs> I think the AFC is a better all-around team. I really do. Their offense is so balanced, and their defense. I mean, their defense is. It, it's okay, but there's not really that kind of. I don't think their front seven is as dominant as the NFC's front seven. Like. They're just so good in the NFC up front. Oh, Mike Allstott. Nice. That's why I was punting, because I didn't know what play I selected. But, yeah, I mean, the NFC's got a really good team. But it, I just if it wasn't for those garbage quarterbacks. 
If and we I had think just I'd one be, of the good quarterbacks that was there before. I think I'd be more inclined to pick them to win. But they have Mitchell Trubisky, Dak Russell Prescott. Wilson, and Dak Prescott. <laughs> when Dak gets checked into that game, he's going to die. <laughs> I don't think he's going to be able Well, no, because he can't blitz. I know, but still. So he can't get hurried. Still. I mean, he's he's got Denzel Ward. Uh-oh. Kurt Wagner. Palomalu. <laughs> he's got Denzel Ward and uh, the other guy. What's the other guy's name? I forgot his name. Uh, the fucking, the other guy from the, the Browns. What's the other guy that plays right next to Denzel? All right, whatever. But he's got a really good secondary waiting for him. When's the last time that three Browns players made the Pro Bowl? How did Baker not make the Pro Bowl? Because Patrick Mahomes. And I guess Andrew Luck. I don't know. Andrew Luck's garbage. Touchdown. But how did either one of those guys... I get Deshaun Watson. I get that, too. Because he's coming off a, an injury. A, a torn ACL. An incredibly disgusting knee injury. But how do you let... Not let... How do you not... A guy who's in the candidate for Rookie of the Year right now. How do you not push him in the Pro Bowl? Who knows? I guess we'll never know. All right, final pick time. Who you got? NFC. AFC. It's going to be a true matchup. True matchup tonight, 3 p.m. So that's going to do it for us, guys. That's going to do it for these Pro Bowl predictions. I hope you enjoyed watching this game that was made in 480i in upscale 1080p. Even though it's not really upscale 1080p, it's just what I recorded it in. So that's going to do it, guys. I hope that you all enjoyed this video, I, there was really no point to making this video. No. It's just like the Pro Bowl. There's no point to it other than to have a, a lot time. of fun. <laughs> only, only to see Saquon Barkley break some more records in the Pro Bowl. Let's do it. <laughs> so that's going to do it for us, guys. I hope that you enjoyed. If you did, drop a comment on this video. Leave a like down below and hit that subscribe button if you want more content just like this garbage. And that's going to do it for me, your boy Hobo, and him, Z Diamond. He's he's currently with his head in his hands because he just missed that throw. Because Tom Brady sucks. Go Rams. And that's <laughs> going to do it for us. And we'll see you guys next week for the Super Bowl predictions and whatever other live videos we do maybe later today. So that's going to do it for us. We'll catch you guys in the next video.